Staying in the United States with wars in Gaza and Ukraine and growing political rest at home, President Joe Biden's approval rating has tanked. According to a poll, he now has the lowest approval rating among all American presidents in the last seven decades. In fact, Donald Trump's term in the White House is being rated higher than President Biden's. However, President Biden still holds a lead over Trump in likability and honesty. Our next report gets you all the details on the latest numbers and what it means for the race for the White House. American President Joe Biden has a new problem on his hands. While juggling the wars in Gaza and Ukraine, growing unrest at home and a stagnating economy, Biden now also has to worry about his job. Appraisal time is approaching. The presidential polls are just six months away. 81-year-old Biden is committed to running for the Oval Office again. Except his popularity is shrinking and his job ratings have taken a stark nosedive. Joe Biden's report card is in and the numbers don't look too good. In fact, Biden has received the lowest job approval rating among presidents in the last 70 years. Biden has secured just above 38 percent in his test. That's lower than Richard Nixon, whose presidency was tainted with the Watergate scandal. Even Donald Trump has a higher job approval rating compared to Biden. One of the biggest reasons for Biden's low approval is young voters. The pro-Palestinian movement in the U.S. has become a major concern for the youth. Thousands of college-going Americans are protesting against the Biden administration's support to Israel for the war in Gaza. And young voters are starting to lose faith in Joe Biden's ability to handle the crisis in the Middle East. We're going to allow this man who is complicit in genocide, who's funding uh, anti-resistance efforts in Yemen and all those places, we're going to allow him to come here and basically desecrate our Morehouse name and tradition because we want the money and because we want, to, to, we want um, our loans paid off. That's very sellout and I don't like that. Closer to home, Biden is also facing criticism as the economy slows down. Young Americans are unhappy with the rising cost of living and the lack of job opportunities. When Joe Biden is compared to his political rival Donald Trump, the current president has a lead in two major categories but trails in four others. Biden is seen as more likable and honest than Trump, whereas Trump is seen as a strong leader and a better administrator. Trump also got more votes for putting his country first and making good judgments in a crisis. The numbers show that American voters hold both candidates in low regard. Neither Biden nor Trump have mustered faith and approval among voters. According to the Gallup poll, no president has returned to the White House when their approval ratings have been below 50 percent. With the October surprise just a few months away, Biden has got a lot of rebranding to do, while Trump needs to stay afloat in the race without drowning in the heap of legal battles. From impeachments to inaugurations, if it's a political story, we are on the scene. The race for the White House is heating up. We're beating Biden. How dare he say that? If it's breaking news, we're live with the latest coverage. From the White House, the State Department, and Capitol Hill, we know the issue, but above all, we know the players to bring you the latest in-depth analysis on all the key stories that we're covering. I'm Eric Ham. Join me from Washington here on First Post America.